Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I would like to talk about spring and um, new, um, bringing the new in because um, I believe in doing like cleanses and good spring cleaning and that includes our face and our hair and whatnot. So I had requested from one of my friends on how to do um, a purifying mask um, so today, I would like to talk about um, my Benonite clay. Um, you could probably find this at any health food store. I carry this one in our shop. It's basically just plain Benonite clay, and I like to miss, miss it, mix it with my toner, which is um, chamomile and mint. And basically I mix the two and then I use them on a face mask and what it does is that it draws out all of the impurities that I've been harboring through winter. Um, so I like to start with this mask and then I go into some more scrubs and like prep my skin for like spring and summer and during this time my skin also needs a lot of moisturization because it's so dry and arid here, especially in the winter. Um, it doesn't really get very humid in the summer unless it's going to rain. So, um, let's get right into the tutorial. It's quite simple. Stick around and then we'll talk about the different processes on how to um, clean and cleanse your skin and what routine I'm using. Alright, let's get started! <laughs> Alright, so we're going to start off with our Benonite clay and we just want to add that to a small bowl. I swear this stuff gets all over the place. Then I will take my chamomile and mint toner and just add a good splash in that. You want to go ahead and mix it. You want to make kind of like a paste consistency, almost like a toothpaste. Then you want to apply it to your face. Don't mind me. Yes, you are going to look equally scary as I do. I'm just going to let it dry. I usually play around on my phone or... And then you want to rinse it off. Et voila! So let's talk about um, a little bit about Benonite clay and what it is. First of all, it's composed of an aged volcanic ash. Now, why is it so amazing if it's volcanic ash? It's a unique clay that produces an electrical charge when it's hydrated. Upon contact with any fluid, its electrical components change, giving the ability to absorb toxins, heavy metals, impurities, and chemicals. Some people actually eat Benonite clay or put them in their smoothies and stuff, but I won't get into that in this video. We're just going to talk about why it's so great for your skin as a mask. It helps bring oxygen to cells. It alkalinizes your pH level on your skin, which is something that I talk about all the time. It leaves your, your skin so smooth and it draws the toxins out, which is the main thing. Like I was saying before, I'm just filled with toxins during um, the winter and this really draws out different impurities. It heals and regenerates skin. It treats acne. It shrinks the pores. It's an excellent light exfoliator. Um, and since it's a light exfoliator, it evens out the skin tone and it prevents blackheads. That's one of the main reasons why I use it is to prevent blackheads. Now I'm going to talk about a little bit about my toner. Um, the toner that we create is a rose water based toner. It does have chamomile, which is great for redness in the skin or keeping the skin um, not as irritated. And then the mint, for me, it's so refreshing. It shrinks the pores. It really gives me a good wake up, awake kind of feeling on my skin. I find that it really helps with my under eye circles and it just smells absolutely amazing. Um, it's part of our toner line. I'd be happy to talk about more about the different toners that we carry at the shop or how to make your own toner, which is very quite easy to do. And um, yeah, I add it as a combination to hydrate the Benonite clay. All right guys, that is it. I hope you enjoyed the video and maybe learned a bit about more information. Um, and please leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe. And 
let me know if you guys have any requests. I will be continuing my spring. I don't know what you're gonna call it. I'm not gonna what you gonna call it. Um, my spring beautifying routine. And I'll see you next week. Bye.